Hello everyone, I'm Catherine Decina Sapolin, your beer mistress, and I have an extra special review for you today. Ta-da! It's a throwback to my very first beer mistress beer review where I tried Bellevue's Extra Creek, and today I'm doing a taste test between the bottle and the can version because I hear that one is supposed to taste better than the other. We shall see. All right, let's open these up. I'm so excited to be trying Extra Creek again because I haven't had one since I tried it last year. And I'm also really excited to see if they taste different or if there's actually any difference at all because I hate to say guys, but I feel like I've sort of become a beer snob because the bottle beer seems so much better than the boring can ones cuz just like look aesthetically the bottle is so much prettier than just the can Ugh. okay just off the bat opening this I got a bigger width than when I opened the bottle the can pours a lot better than the bottle right off the start color wise they look exactly the same I don't see a difference. I feel the head on this is slightly lighter than the head on this one, but that could also be because there's more foam. Let's smell these. Ooh, this does smell delightful, but it doesn't smell like real cherries. It smells really sweet. I mean, it does smell like cherries, but it's like an artificial cherry smell. Oh, there's no smell coming off of this one. Okay, when it comes to smell, the bottle is the winner. This, there is the slightest, and I mean really slight cherry flavor that's coming from this one. But this has a more profound aroma coming off of it. Like it smells delicious and this just, it doesn't smell at all. If these taste differently, like I, I'm, I'm going to be shocked. So here we go with our beers, his own set. We're gonna try the bottle first because I'm a snob. Ooh, I don't remember this being so sour. Oh, this is delightful. It's like a sour cherry. There's sweetness, but there's more sour coming off of it. And there's this burst of carbonation and I really, really like it. Now we're gonna try the canned version. Zolt it. Oh my god, they taste different. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, there, there is an actual taste difference. I'm so shocked right now. This has a lot more sweetness in it and there is there is a sour note, but it's so subtle. It, it barely registers on my tongue and there's almost no carbonation. The purpose of this video was so that I could come on here and be like, guys, don't be a snob. Canned beer is just as good as bottled beer. It's not. I mean, it's not bad, but the taste difference is so, so different. Like this could be a whole other beer. If you took this and changed the label and you said, okay, this is a beer and then this is a beer, I would totally believe it because they do not taste the same. Bottled beer is so much better. I feel, I feel like this might need to be a thing where I get bottled beers and canned beers and taste the difference because I, I genuinely cannot believe how much of a difference there is in the taste. Like this, I would almost say, isn't worth drinking if you know that the bottle exists because this tastes so much better in my opinion. Guys, I pose this question in my beer enthusiast group and I was told that there actually isn't supposed to be a difference between the two and that in fact canned beer is supposed to be better provided that the beer doesn't go through a second fermentation in the bottle because it stays fresher in here. So maybe this is actually how it's supposed to taste because the shelf life is better and like you don't have the sun to mess with the beer because that's a problem with the beer that's why the bottles aren't clear if you didn't know that but taste wise this one was so much better 
and who knows, maybe I'm projecting my own biases, but I like this taste better because there was more going on because you had the sour note, the sweet note, and the carbonation, and this just sort of tasted sweet with a tiny bit of carbonation. Also, if you had either of these beers, did you like it? For myself, I don't remember it tasting this sour. Of course, it has been a year since I tried it last, but I enjoyed this. And if you haven't seen that video, it will be where links are. You should check it out. And if you're new, hit the subscribe button. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Check out the description because I have links to all my social media. You should check me out. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Tote scenes, my apple zines. It's a Saint Bernardus with two glass. I can fit all my bottle caps in this glass, which means I'll have two free glasses to drink beer. And I'm so happy because Saint Bernardus is like a great brewery. It's official, guys. My beer glass collection has started. I named them all. It's gonna be like Pokemon.